What's going on, Internet? Today we have one of our most luxurious lines, the Winnebago Voyage. This is the 2730RL. If you would like something a little bit larger, we do also currently have in stock the 3235RL, but this video is going to be dedicated to this particular one. We do have another video available if you would like to see the 2730RL. So this is also a rear living coach. It's 31 feet total. It weighs about 7,500 pounds empty and 10,400 pounds gross vehicle weight rating. It's got a total exterior height of 11 and a half inches and is eight feet wide. So it's got really great interior space. If you want a fifth wheel feel in a bumper pool format, the Voyage is definitely the way to go. So starting out up front, we have a very unique 5.1 leveling system. All you have to do is power it on. You can select retract or extend. You can do just the tongue jack, each jack individually or all stabilizer jacks. So we'll go ahead and show you how it works for all stabilizer jacks. We'll press and hold. So in less than 30 seconds, you have all your stabilizer jacks down. With some other RVs, you'll have one button on the outside for one jack or one button for the front and one button for the back. So this is gonna save you time so you can enjoy more of your camping trips. Here we have two propane tanks in the front. These are 30 gallons each, 60 gallons total. The reason why that's important is that we have a fully heated and enclosed underbelly with this RV. So we have a winter like last year, you're definitely gonna need propane to protect your plumbing, but we also have 12 volt tank heater pads that we'll show you inside. Right over here, we have a full size spare tire at Cliff Jones. We'll make sure that your battery is installed. No hidden freight charges, no hidden uh, freight charges like our competitors. So we'll top off the propane, install the battery, wash the detail it, do a full system check and give you a walkthrough with our technician. Right here, we have a pass through storage. On the other side, we have the water workstation that we'll show you as we get over there. One thing I really like about the Winnebago's is that we have magnets on the doors instead of clips. They're really easy to open with one hand and if those clips become brittle and break, that's one less thing to worry about with this design. If you see here, we have this blue hose for the spray port. This offers you a cold water shower on this side. We also have a large electric awning as well with white LED lights to illuminate your camping area. As you see here, all the windows are tinted for more privacy and energy efficiency. For a coach this size, you'd easily be looking at $1,000 if you had it done after the fact, so it's more built-in savings with the Voyage. We also have marine grade speakers on the outside. They offer great audio. You can play just inside, just outside, or both. If you wanna hook up a TV, we have power here, coaxial here. And going to the door, one thing I like to point out about the Winnebago's, they have a taller and wider entrance than others. This is also a friction hinge door, so it holds self open to moderate wind. And another great thing is that we have a screen door here too. So you can keep those pesky Texas mosquitoes out. And then you have this little access door here if you wanna open the main door, but easily keep bugs out. Another great thing about Winnebago is that they include the thin shade. As you see here, the door has a window. So for more privacy, you can operate this thin shade. If you wanna open it to get more natural light, just slide it right down like so. Another great thing is that we have the more right step above steps. These have three steps so that have a very low point of entrance. And if you're ready to go, if you wanna to go to your next destination, they lift right up like so. You have a little security latch here, and then you can adjust the feet to different ground heights as well. And then while we're here too, I wanna to point out that we have Goodyear 15 inch endurance tires, some of the best tires on the market. With other brands, that's gonna be a very quick upgrade, but with this one, it's already on the unit. Go ahead and bring these back down. And then we also have the extra large door handle as well to make it really easy to get in and out. And just talking about the construction of the Winnebago really quick, this is an aluminum frame. It's much stronger and lighter than wood. The sidewalls are laminated for better insulation. And what's behind the fiberglass is Asdel, the substrate. You have less than a 1% chance of delamination. It's stronger and lighter than wood. Better insulation as well. It's better for the environment. And if it ever gets wet, it does not mold or mildew. So coming down this way, we have one of our slides. This is more compact compared to the 20, or excuse me, the 3235RL, but it still gives you much more interior space versus others. Here on the back, we have a ladder already pre-installed. So you can inspect your roof as you should periodically. We also have a large window in the back as well, so you can enjoy your views wherever you are. We also have prep for a Voyager camera. You get audio and video one way. Here we have the bumper, great spot for your sewer hose. And then we also have a receiver hitch down here rated for 250 pounds. So if you wanna put a bike rack or something else, you can easily do that as well. With the tail lights, we have LEDs. They're much brighter and therefore much safer and they'll also last much longer than incandescent bulbs. This is gonna be the other slide with the entertainment center. This unit is 50 amp power because it does have two ACs. 
Where we're located at in the dealership right now, we only have 30 amp power with one AC on, but it is ducted throughout. So if you're camping somewhere with only 30 amp power, you can easily do that. That's the intake and exhaust for the furnace. Here we have the black tank flush to easily clean out your toilet tank. Here we have a water heater, it's a 10 gallon. Most other RVs are six gallons, so you get four additional gallons of hot water with the Winnebago Voyage. Here we have the fresh water fill. We also have cable and satellite prep as well. This RV has built-in solar to run a 12 volt systems off grid. So there we have the solar controller. We also have power here, battery disconnects. So if you ever store your RV, your battery won't deplete as fast. And then we have a second outdoor shower with hot and cold water as well. City water connection here, and you can easily switch from city to fresh right here. And speaking of the tanks, this has a 60 gallon fresh tank. So if you're off grid, you can operate the water pump to circulate water. And then we have a 49 gallon black tank and a 49 gallon gray tank as well. So you don't have to dump your tanks as often. So other than that, on the outside, that's about it. We do have these white lights in the LED cap. It looks really great and gives you additional lighting when you're hooking and unhooking in darker conditions. So here we are inside the Winnebago 2730 RL. It has seven feet of ceiling height, which is super tall for a travel trailer. We have this slide here with the super comfortable recliners. We also have a couch that easily converts into a bed. Great overhead storage too. One thing I like to point out about the Winnebago's is that these have the hinges that hold themselves open. With many other brands, you're gonna have to add that after the fact, but not with Winnebago. Here we have the entertainment center. TV is included, JBL stereo for better audio, and a fireplace for secondary heat or just to generate a light show. We also have a wireless phone charger down here, USB and power and extra storage below. One of the highlights of this RV is gonna be that the entertainment center has this hidden pantry. So you have plenty of storage for an extended stay, but it's a really efficient way to get extra storage. And it just closes like so. And then here we have the residential power fridge. This is 422 liters total. It's 12 volts, so you have more interior space and it cools down much faster. We also have the freezer below as well. And right over here, we have the residential size microwave. It is convection, so you can bake in it. This is really hard to find a full-size microwave in a travel trailer. Here we have the three burner cooktop. It is recessed to give you extra counter space. This is rolls back, rolls back like so to act as a backsplash as well. And then you also have night lights and an oven as well. Plenty of drawers here for utensils. We also have storage below as well. And then here we have a one piece undermount stainless steel sink, much more sanitary than plastic and easier to keep clean. And then we also have power here as well for coffee maker, blender, crock pot, whatever you might need. We also have extra overhead storage here too. And then right here, we have the brain of the RV, the control panel. So this is where you control the slides, the awning, the lights, outside lights. And one thing I really appreciate about Winnebago is that with your propane electric water heater, you can switch it from propane to electric on the inside. So if it's cold outside, if it's raining, with others, you're gonna have to go outside and physically do the switch, but it's uh, located right here very conveniently. We also have the water pump switch as well, if you wanna circulate water off grid. And then we also have the 12 volt tank heater pads as well. So you have two layers of protection from the cold, especially if we have a winter like last year. This is gonna be the thermostat for the main AC. This also controls your furnace. We have a light switch here for the hallway. Here we have the master. This is a king size bed as well. We also have a second AC too. So whenever you're on 50 amp power, you can operate this. If you want a quick cool, just open this right up and it will cool the bedroom down very quickly. We also have a ward on each side for hanging clothes as well. Shelf overhead, power on both sides of the bed. And right over here, we have additional storage as well. And if you wanna place the TV here, it is ready for that. Here we have the bathroom, really great size, plenty of room to change. And we have a large shower too, coupled with the skylight, you have plenty of headroom space and this also gives you natural light. Another thing I like to point out about the Winnebago's as well, we do have porcelain toilets, which is reserved for high-end RVs. Stainless steel in the kitchen and in the bathroom as well, which is really hard to find. Here we have the power button to open and close the fan as well. And then here we have additional storage and also a pre-hung towel rack as well. 
So here we have the Winnebago Voyage 2730RL. We're having a huge sale right now. Tens of thousands of dollars off these units. We have it in stock here in Sealy. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like and share. And thank you so much for watching.